Weird and wonderful, take one. Thank you. This is Caleb here, our intern from prison. Thank you very much. Okay, so we're gonna do another session of Weird and Wonderful. It's gonna be beautiful. Now, do you know what this is? Yes, this is your everyday leafy, non-waxed lemon. Oh yes. But today is a time where we don't just have that kind of lemon, we have this kind of lemon. Yeah, we're talking a big lemon, a big badass lemon. This, my friends, is the one and only Cedro lemon. It is a citrus fruit, it is a member of the lemon family, but whereas this, if cut in half, gives you your normal juicy lemon situation across the near sham, this is what we get here which is, as you can see, not particularly juicy. If you come forward, have a look at this. If you have a look in there, uh, this pith, unlike this lemon, is not bitter. This is a neutral pith. It's also quite firm. If you can look in there, it's quite firm. And also, you can see that the skin is knobbly like an old man's nose. An important thing is you, you can't go using this delicately if you're gonna clank it up all chunky. You don't want that in your salad. So we need to use some skills. Now that comes in the form of knife skills uh, or our dear friend, Mr. Mandolin. Go as fine as you think you can get away with. The finer you can get it, the better it will be. Uh, when you use your mandolin, use a guard because you don't want to cut yourself. I know I'm setting a bad example today, but I lost my guard. And that is how my fourth child was born. Over here, we're gonna do a bruschetta. Um, br some people say bruschetta, it's bruschetta. What is it, bruschetta? It's not bruschetta. Jim, is it bruschetta? Bruschetta. Bruschetta. See? Si. Okay, back here. Um, sourdough bread, um, about a centimetre thick. We are gonna to toast. We are going to put our cheddar lemon in. So put in some lemon juice. We're gonna go in with a, a pinch of salt, very important, and some very good olive oil. I'm gonna choose a herb. Mint is really, really good. Uh, I might take some mint and just chop it up. I'm gonna do that now and just finely chop the mint. Um, the thing I really love about Italian food is there is a simplicity there. So let's finally slice some chilies. So in you go, my friend. A little wadge of um, rocket. We're gonna just toss this up like that. Let's get a little bit of garlic. Just cut it in half. It's a bruschetta, so just rub it a few times. We're then gonna drizzle it with good olive oil again. Get a couple of little tomatoes. And once you've rubbed it with garlic and olive oil, just get a tomato, squeeze it a bit, and just squash that tomato in and around the whole toast, and you can leave it on the toast as well. Then we come to our mozzarella. We're gonna tear this open, okay? And we're gonna kind of unwind it. See how it's unwinding? We're gonna unwind that little beautiful thing. Toss up your salad. When it looks pretty in the bowl, just pick it up. We're gonna go on top. Very simple, very unusual, definitely weird and wonderful. So look at that. That, my friends, is the bruschetta with cheddar, lemon, rocket, mint, chili, and buffalo mozzarella. If you like this video, please like it. If you want to comment, then please comment. And if you haven't subscribed, then hit there to subscribe. Go on, hit it, please. Grazie. Grazie. Until next time, we will have loads more weird and wonderful. And don't forget, people are watching this from all over the world. If you know of an ingredient that is unusual, let us know. Send it in. Cue the music. Caleb, go on, cue it. Don't throw, don't throw the lemon. Eat the lemon, you don't throw the lemon. <laughs>